Welcome to 1000 PS. Welcome to Birmingham Live Motorcycle Show here in the UK. And welcome to KTM's new 990 Duke. Well, at Live from Motorcycle Live uh, here in Birmingham, here in the UK, a bike that I'm looking forward to riding, KTM's new 90 Duke. We've got Simon here from KTM UK. Tell us a little bit more about it, please. Well, I think I'm as, as excited as you about this bike coming. I mean, one look at it just shows you the intent of it. So, I mean, from the, bo from the bottom, it's ground up, it's a new bike. So obviously people see new bikes and they think, oh, you know, that's just a, a, a bigger uh, 890 or something like that. But no, you know, this has been a, a ground up revolution of the bike. So in the middleweight class, we're, we're hoping that it knocks spots off of absolutely everything out there. And, and looks wise, I think it will do that. But at the heart of it, it's a, it's a new engine, uh, so we've obviously increased the capacity there. Uh, new crank, new pistons, things like that. So all new on the engine front, all new on the frame front as well. So you know we want to give this bike as, as much feel for the customer when they're riding as possible. So new suspension, new suspension settings. So I think you'll feel that as and when you go on the launch. Uh, and then it's all packaged up uh, in this really aggressive uh, new, new plastics and then I think the culmination of that is the the love or hate uh, front light I don't know if uh, if you know about Marmite but uh, there's a condiment in the UK called Marmite that you either love or hate so um, the more people see it in the flesh the more they like it so I think we need to take this bike to every customer and then they'll fall in love with it but yeah you can't deny it's not aggressive <laughs> now me and you have known each other a long long time we remember the 950 V twin Dukes yeah. and yeah. when it went bigger as well yeah, yeah. and they had no rider aids but I'm assuming we've got something to help us now yeah exactly um, yeah back in the day it was all seat of the pants stuff and everything was on the throttle but we've got some uh, some things to make life a little bit easier for you now so we've got uh, obviously traction control ABS supermoto ABS so uh, we've got a suite of electronics that are standard it will give you everything that this bike has got to offer but uh, there are optional extras which are available through the demo mode, so it's a try before you buy scheme. Uh, these just finesse that bike, finesse the bike a little further on. So we're not saying that you must have them and you must pay for them, but it's the option. If you like them, then the opportunity is there for you to have them. But yeah, the, the electronics are there to really add an element of safety, but then allow you to push your riding further and further and further. Now, looking forward to riding the bike. Hopefully that's going to be around early February. Yes. Uh, in terms of if somebody actually wants to buy these, can they go into a UK dealer and buy them today? Uh, not today. You can put a deposit down today. So, yeah, we'd encourage you to, to go down and if you want to be first in line, go and see your KTM dealer in the UK and, and put your name down for that. Um, but, yeah, we'll be seeing bikes coming through you know, early-ish 2024, so January, February sort of time. So, real exciting time for that. The launch will be around then as well. So. I guess stay tuned to all of Adam's channels for, um, for, for your verdict on the bike. Cool, mate. Thanks for your time. I'm looking forward to riding it in February. Yeah. Cheers, mate. Now, let's forget about the looks for a second because that's questionable because not everybody finds me attractive, obviously. But let's talk about the 990 Duke. We've had the full specs from Simon Roots at KTM and on paper, it looks impressive. And I remember the old V-Twin Duke because I actually raced one when they were supporting the British Superbike paddock. And I love that bike, and this has the potential to be the same. It's got good power, it's got a good chassis, it's got good electronics. Every time I ride a new KTM, the launches are always extreme and impressive. This has got fully adjustable WP suspension. We're going to have a plethora of riding ears to keep us safe. It should have good power and it should have good performance. Now, the 890 Duke is a firm favourite of mine. It handles so well. Jeremy Williams and the designers at KTM and the chassis engineers have got it spot on. KTM always come out of the box with a well handling bike. I'm going to be riding this bike in early February. Can't wait to ride it. Hopefully it'll be a bit of track and a bit of street and hopefully I can chase those KTM test riders. It'll be a great fun. Let us know what you think of the video. Give us a thumbs up, give us a thumbs down. And I think the big question mark is going to be, do we like the face?